thread whiskers really add character to this polymer clay orange and white sleeping cat. I'll show you how to make it in just a few simple steps. For this project, you'll need orange, white, and black polymer clay, a toothpick, thread, scissors, and a non-metal baking dish. Start by making a log shape for the body of the cat and shape it into a jelly bean or a kidney bean shape. Roll a skinny snake to make the stripe on the back. Flatten it out and press it onto the back. Use a toothpick on each side to make the stripe look furry. Start in the middle with your toothpick and pull the clay out to the sides into the orange. Do this on each side of the stripe. Roll two short logs about a half inch each to make the front uh, legs. And to make the paws, take a small ball of white clay and stick it on to the end of the logs. Use the toothpick to draw the white clay into the orange clay so it looks furry just like you did with the white stripe on the back. Press the front legs into position so they're curled around the front of the body. Roll a log of clay to make the tail that's just long enough to go from the rear end of the cat almost touching the front paw when you curl it around the body. Add a little bit of white clay on the end just like you did the front paws and use a toothpick to draw the white clay into the orange. Press the tail firmly into the place on the back of the body and curl it to go along with the shape of the body. Roll a slight oval shape to make the head. Press it into the place on the body, resting the chin on the two front paws. Flatten two small balls to make the ears of the cat. Roll two smaller balls of white clay. Set them inside the ears and press them flat. Pinch the top of each ear so it makes a triangular shape. And then use the toothpick to make fur. Set the ears in place on the head using the toothpick to make a crease in the middle as you press them into the head. Roll two small white balls and press them into the head to make the cat's muzzle. Use the toothpick to draw slightly downward pointing slits to make sleepy eyes on the cat. Cut six pieces of thread about a quarter inch each. Press three pieces of thread into each of the white balls. Use the end of the toothpick to poke the thread securely into place. Add a tiny black ball for a nose right at the top in between the two white balls. Use the toothpick to make the rest of the body, tail, feet, and head look furry.
Place the cat in a non-metal baking dish and follow the clay manufacturer's instructions for baking. It will likely be 275 degrees Fahrenheit for about 20 to 30 minutes. After the project is baked and completely cooled, you're finished. Please subscribe to my channel so I can keep bringing you new craft ideas every week.